Hello, welcome again to Invictus Porsche. We have here this Porsche 911 997.1. This is rare for a few reasons, and one of them being the fact that this has only covered 54,000 miles since 2004. And, um, but let's dive into it. Um, this is an Arctic Silver. I love the styling of the uh, 997.1s uh, because they go away from the fried egg headlight shapes that you find on the 996, which to some of us are very undesirable, uh, but as well as the uh, beautiful Arctic Silver. This comes with the 18 inch Carrera Alloys, which has got plenty of tread. The styling in terms of aerodynamic continues with these beautiful design side mirrors, the door handle, the swooping arches and the retractable spoiler at the back that comes on. This has got a beautiful sounding exhaust system, but should want want, they could easily upgrade this to a switchable sports exhaust system. Interior is absolute top notch on this, starting from the sunroof right here, which allows in plenty of sunlight and air to make it nice and airy inside this beautiful cabin space. It's got Alcantara headlining. This is an extended leather package with uh, matching color, um, you know, exterior body stitching uh, that you find here, which I think adds a really nice touch to it. This has got the sports steering wheel, which is also multifunctional. It's got the Chrono Sports Plus package. So by pressing that button, the car just becomes so much more drantier and roaring as, as you would expect from a proper sports car. As well as having two seats at the front, the benefit of having a 911 is another two seats at the back, which is very convenient because you don't have to just worry about getting a child um, in at the back of this, but you can actually quite comfortably get a five foot eight, five foot ten adult like myself in there. With Invictus Porsche, you can buy with absolute peace of mind, and that is because every single Porsche goes through a 111 point pre purchase inspection, as well as a bore scope inspection and an over rev report to give you the absolute peace of mind that this engine is running as it should when it first left the factory. And I can genuinely tell you that from my experience of driving this car for the past 30, 40 minutes, it's been an absolute joy of a car in terms of the uh, experience that you get from interacting with the manual box, the clutch, the steering wheel, and the braking system. And it actually produces a phenomenal amount of power. This produces 321 brake horsepower, 370 Newton meters of torque. The top speed is 170 miles per hour, and it is able to do not to 62 miles per hour in 5.0 seconds. The total weight of this car is 1,395 kilograms, and the combined MPG that you get from this phenomenal looking 911 is 25. A service history point of view, this has in total six stamps in the service book and it's got a fair number of invoices to illustrate what kind of maintenance work it's had done. In terms of owner's history, this, as you can see from the sticker, belonged to somebody from the Porsche Owners Club, which meant it would be somebody that took care of their Porsche. But at the same time, he's actually owned it since um, August 2019 and in total, uh, this has five owners since new but one thing i can tell you is that looking at the condition of this 911 it is absolutely spot on i can't see any signs of this having previous bodywork there's no dents scratches or scuff anywhere on the bodywork so it goes to show that from the first impression this is a very well looked after 911 which i think in my opinion will make it very sought after considering all the spec, which is the Chrono Sports Plus, the Boza, uh, I mean, the low mileage, the good number of owners, and the kind of person that has owned it previously. From a driver engagement's point of view, a 911 is a phenomenal car to have because of the heritage, but also because of how it drives. Let's close that sunroof so we get a proper driver's orientated drive out of this 911. The manual gearbox on this is, is so easy. It changes gears 
with so much fluidity and ease and there is no delay in the gear changes. It grips to the road very well because it's got a lot of tread on the tires but at the same time the suspension, the control arms, everything is performing as it really should. The 911s traditionally are known for the way they handle and the way they grip to the road and it, 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 it's out of convention uh, for a car to have an engine at the back and Porsches have really specialized and perfected the technique of having a car with an engine at the back that performs as well as they do. Porno on display is used to record your lap times but pressing that sports button, let's drop the window. the noise from the engine completely changes. This becomes a happy high revving 911. Of course, rev it, you know, when you want to beyond four or 5,000 RPM when the engine is absolutely warm, but what a true pleasure it is to drive a car with sports chrono as an option because it completely changes the dynamic of the feel that you get from the steering, the feel that you get from the road, the gear changes, the fact that again it becomes a high revving car which is what you would want on a nice day, on a nice sunny day out like this to take your Porsche 911 and you know take it for a lovely drive out there. If you've enjoyed our video so please don't forget to comment, like and subscribe and should you have any questions about this Porsche feel free to reach out to us all about a Porsche that you own or you're potentially looking to buy a Porsche somewhere down uh, the line uh, or something that we don't have in stock. You know, ask us anything you want to ask us. We're very happy to interact with our customers and engage with our customers and possibly provide the best customer service in the UK of any Porsche specialist.